Hi, hello, friends. How are you doing? This is your buddy, Stiple. So today I am here with an, another useful video. So here in this video, we are going to see how to run a disk surface test on your hard disk, on your hard disk or a solid state device. Um, sometimes when performing some specific operations or open some files, you might feel that your computer is running significantly slow or the disk, the hard disk keep kept to be ticking. Such problems might occur when there are some bad sectors on your hard disk. Uh, nevertheless, in this case, how you would confirm whether there is a bad sector. So for this, it is like uh, we have a solution called running a disk surface test. So how we are going to do is we are going to uh, do a disk surface test uh, for free using a third party tool. So that is what we are going to see in this video. So let's get started. So the free tool which I am talking is called Mini Tool Partition Wizard. So you can go to your browser and you can search for download Mini Tool Partition Wizard. So it will, uh, so the official website is www.partitionwizard.com. You can go in there and herein you can see, uh, you go to for home and uh, select part down, but download Partition Wizard for free. So you can just download the free edition in the free edition itself. You have uh, you have this option to run disk surface test. Okay, so you can click download now. So in my case, I have already downloaded that, and I have installed the application. So let me launch it. Mini tool partition vision. Okay, so I am launching the application. So herein, I do have it is like two disks. Disk one is uh, my solid state device which I have newly bought. And uh, disk two is my existing hard disk drive. So I can run surface test on both of these two. Let's say in case uh, sometimes it is like if you bought a new device and if you want to verify on your own whether that device has no bad sectors or not, you can use this or you can run on your existing uh, hard disk device as well. So let me try to run it on my new device on this disk one. So for this, what I have to do is either I can right click on that disk where I have to run the surface test and I can click surface test. So it will throw a pop-up like this, or else if we can go to disk surface test. So this also will take us to the surface test menu. So let me run it. So all the time going to run surface test on disk one, click surface test. And here you can see it will say, uh, so if it, um, so it will just give you a rough picture of your disk in uh, square blocks. If it is, with the uh, if you if it's if you see it with green color this means that disk block has no error and in case if you if it has any uh, read error uh, then you will see it is in red color so let me start the disk surface test so you can see that it is started and how much percent is completed is displayed on the top so like as i said earlier if there are some bad sectors uh, we first uh, we can uh, if we found any bad sectors we can transfer all data on this disk out and use any specific software to seal the bad tracks. Okay, so the the test is going through. It will it will take some considerable time. Okay, in my case, uh, the test has been completed and I can see that uh, all sectors were in green color. Luckily. So if in case you are seeing any red sectors, what you can do is that uh, you can either look for replacement of that particular hard disk or solid state drive, or you can run any uh, any third party tool which can do disk cleanup or disk recovery, uh, or, uh, or it is like a disk health test to fix these bad sectors. Okay guys, that's it. Hope you guys enjoy this video. If you have any queries, feel free to. Let me know in the comment section. If you like the video, please give a thumbs up. And until then, it's cheers to buddy, stable.